Food insecurity is an issue impacting thousands of Central Floridians. Local organizations say there are a number of reasons why families are faced with going to bed hungry at night. The Second Harvest Food Bank of Central Florida says the number of people using this food finder tool jumped by more than 2,500 compared to last June. New 6's Emily McLeod spoke with Second Harvest and Light Orlando, two groups working together to get results and get food on families' tables. Organizations across Central Florida are doing everything they can to combat hunger in our communities. The Second Harvest Food Bank of Central Florida says they've seen a big increase in the number of people using their food finder resource tool. They say after the COVID-19 pandemic, it's been a struggle for many to get back to normal. Prior to the COVID-19 pandemic, the Second Harvest Food Bank of Central Florida was distributing 150,000 meals a day. That number doubled during the pandemic, and Maureen Mickle says the needle hasn't moved much since then. Unfortunately, that need has just consistently stayed about the same since the pandemic at about 300,000 meals every single day that we're distributing. Mickle says they hoped that number would drop, but searches on the organization's online food finder tool have increased over the last year. In June 2022, there were 7,100 searches using the food finder tool. In June 2023, that number jumped 36% to 9,700. We are seeing an uptick in that uh, due to rising costs of virtually everything, inflation, lack of affordable housing mixed with this heat right now. You know, utility bills are out of control. But Second Harvest isn't alone in this fight. Light Orlando is also helping feed families by partnering with U.S. Hunger to pack 500,000 meals that will be distributed to charities who feed families across Central Florida. We're seeing a lot more individuals that you did, wouldn't have thought would be struggling with different kinds of in, food insecurity because of the, the housing market, interest, inflation, and stuff that's gone up. Troy Wright with Light Orlando says with the help of 1,400 volunteers, packing 500,000 meals will be one of their largest largest endeavors yet. They'll pack those meals at the Central Florida Fairgrounds on August 12th. Those things that 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 we typically would argue about or those things that maybe would, would make us not be friends or not hang out on a Friday night, they, they're suddenly gone. So it's really just a linking of arms and, and joining forces for the common good. If you are in need of food assistance or you'd like to sign up to volunteer at Light Orlando's packing event, you can head to our website, clickorlando.com. In Orlando, I'm Emily McLeod, getting results, News 6.